Howdy y'all, this is your boy Beastamon, and today we will be doing this arcade game called Armies of the Night. And no, contrary to how it sounds, it is not a horror game or a vampire game. Um, before I start, I do want to talk about a couple things, so I'm going to stay here at the door because that chick is talking too loud. You know what? I'm getting tired of her. Give me this thing. The hell up. Okay, anyway, sorry about that. So I'm going to talk over here, um, so yeah, I'm going to do Armies of the Night, I know I'm standing near the Rumble Mode machine, but I'm not going to do that yet. Um, yeah, Army of the Night is like, pretty much just like the Warriors, but it's like one of those retro fighter games that you'd see in the late 80s, early 90s. Um, except with obviously upgraded graphics. If there was a Kryptonite for this game, uh, Armies of the Night is for me because it's very hard, there's like five chapters. And, um... Well, you'll see when we get to it. I don't know. I don't remember a lot about Armies of the Night because I hate playing it. So I'm gonna get started. I'm gonna try to do this. Wish me luck. Okay, here's stage one. Um. Oh God. I'm glad they took mercy. I have no idea why the Rifts took mercy. It doesn't make sense, but they took mercy. So yeah, it's one of these games. Um, except obviously, like I said, upgraded graphics. I mean, come on, this game released in 2005. Yeah, and you have time limit to reach your destination. And also another player can join. I think if they join their Ajax automatically. This game is very hard to me. Um, it's less forgiving than the actual game. You know, than the Warriors, you know, the story mode part portion of it. So yeah, obviously you go through the game defeating various gangs, you go out through, throughout the neighborhoods, and it's based on the story, kind of, sort of. So yeah, you're going to deal with the stories first, because they're the first gang you encounter as your rivals. And yeah, I couldn't grab them right away, um, until I got near them close enough for them to attack. Finish. Yeah, so I, I probably will get game overs on this, so I will be cutting footage probably a lot. Um, I'm not very good at this game. Yeah, you can do your combo. There are certain things you can't do. And yeah, there's credits in the corner. Um, I don't need to explain how credits work if you played, you know, arcade games like this from back then. Uh, uh, credits are pretty much your lives. When you run out, the game is over. And yes, you do have to start at the beginning of the whole entire game if you fail. So try not to do that. And yes, uh, yeah, so when you get uh, Flash, that counts as health for your life, not for credits, but for your life. So yeah, if you faint, uh, that's a credit. But if you get Flash before, then it just restores your health. Okay, you guys are pissing me off. Head into wall. Wait, is that a one-hit kill for every enemy or just the destroyers? Oh, come on, you could have got closer than that, dude. So yeah, I don't like this... Um, it's very hard in my opinion. <laughs> and it's even worse because it's on hard. And yeah, at the end of every level you're gonna see a ball. Oh. It's Virgil. Um, it's Virgil, Beansy, and freaking Lemmy. Yeah, so at the beginning, the, uh, your rivals aren't that tough. But they get tougher. Yeah, it's a good idea to take out Virgil first, no matter what. Oh, we gotta go up here. I do respect Armies of the Night for being unique. That is, like, completely unique. But, I don't like this. I always die in, like, either stage 4 or stage 3. 3 or 4 I die, so... You know. It's not fun to die. My, my thing is just keep smashing people's heads into the wall. It works out well. And yeah, you do have a time limit. I don't know what happens if you fail to reach whatever you're supposed to reach in a time limit. I guess you lose a credit automatically or something. I don't know. I assume that's what happened because nothing else would make sense. It doesn't make sense the game is over because, you know. And face goes into wall. What, are you going to come down here or what? Okay, I guess you're not. Watch him try to sneak up behind me, though. See, I knew it. Get your ass over here. I don't know if Army of the Knights has a high score. 
crap. <sighs> yeah, I'm running out of health already. So I may here's the thing. Um if you're still watching this, I'm gonna cut clips and if I fail, I'm just gonna <laughs> I'm just gonna make it into uh post commentary. Not because the audio failed, but because it's easier that way. Oh shoot, what the heck did I just do? Oh he died. That's a credit. Yes, I have six credits now. Yeah, so I'm not that good at this. Um, you are gonna need to beat this though to get uh, get up to 100%. You know, get towards your 100% goal. And yeah, it's kind of embarrassing that I failed um, the first stage, but I'm not good at this. This is like the only part of the game I will not play. And you got the shit slapped out of you. I have no idea if you're able to get more credits. Um, if not, this is really not good. Okay. Is that the end of stage? No, it's not the end of stage one, damn it. So yeah, you're probably wondering why we um You're probably wondering why did we um Why did we fight the uh yeah, this is supposed to be following the story, but you're probably wondering why we fought the Jones Street Boys. It's all about proximity to the Warriors, so they're in Bentonhurst. That's pretty close to Coney, so that's why you fought them second. And then I guess next to them is the uh, Satan's Mothers. Oh, I was about to say, they, do they really not see me? I know the one guy did. Yeah, so it helps to smash people's heads into the wall. So yeah, obviously you can tell we're going to be fighting... Uh, Tiny and Spider pretty soon. At least one of them. Bitch. What is that? Oh. <laughs> yeah, I'm sort of sitting far away from the TV. Oh, that's just wonderful, Swan. Yeah, so it helps if you're playing this to um, play with two players. I don't know if you play with two players and you beat it, does it count towards your 100? I don't know. I don't play this game with two players. Uh, yeah. People I have played with, uh, they're like, it's too complicated. This game's too complicated. But uh, people that play are less, you know. Okay, you guys are pissing me off. Yeah, and I can't smash them into the wall either, so. Aw, oh, shoot. He was freaking low on health. That's just great. <sighs> I'm not doing that great. Um, so yeah, this might be recorded several times. Come on, Swan. You know better than this. Really, Swan? Oh my god. This is sad. Hell, I could have had Rembrandt and he would have did better. All he had to do was spray him in the eye and they wouldn't be able to see. I've already burnt two credits. This is embarrassing. Oh yeah, I forgot you could do that. You could throw people out the window just when there's a window near. Oh, his face went. And you went out. Yay. Fuck you. Wait, what the heck just... Oh, I threw him out the window. No, you're not doing that, but I will do this. And try to make sure... I'm not sure they can throw you out the window, but I imagine they can. Make sure they don't do that. Oh boy. This is not good. Yep. Pretty much. I'm pretty sure you still can't throw tiny, so. Okay, where the heck is Spider? He didn't die, so where the heck is he? Okay, yeah, it's a good idea not to stand close to the, um, that's one thing I wish I didn't do. I stood too close to the edge when I was fighting those three Satan's mothers earlier. And, yeah. There's no barrier saying, oh, well, you could throw them, you know, and it counts as a wall, even though you can't move any further, so it still counts as a wall. 
So yeah, I completed stage one, lost two lives. This is not going to end well if that's the case. I'm pretty sure I only get seven, so I have like five lives left. I'm not sure if having zero counts of life or as soon as you reach zero, it's game over, but... Oh shit, we're in Chinatown. <sighs> you really didn't do a lot of damage, did you? That's effed up. So that means we're going to be fighting ghosts real soon. So yeah, it does follow the story, but it follows you most... How should I say this? It's all about um, distance, so... That means some of the last people we might fight are the Turnbulls. I'm guessing. It's been a while. Wait, is he dead? That other guy? Okay, I just threw him into a wall and he died. I didn't slam him into a wall, I just threw him into a wall and he died, so I don't know what that's about. Oh, crap. Oh, here we go. Okay, do I not have to finish that combo and he- Yep, he died. I don't even have to finish the combo. Well, that's interesting. Think he's so freaking funny, huh? Yeah, sometimes it just helps to do combos. And I got a knife. What's that? Okay, yeah. I punched the guy and apparently he was moving and then he fainted for some random reason. Don't act like I don't see you over there trying to order something. No mandarin oranges for you. Oh, come on, Spawn. What the heck? You had him, you grabbed him, and then what happened? Oh, God. Let's just hope Ghost doesn't do a combo on him, because the minute he does, this is bad. They shouldn't have made it so we saw him at all, really. If he's really Ghost, we shouldn't have... What the heck was that? Okay, I guess that's the number one thing I'm going to be saying is what the heck is that and what, what's going on? Really, dude? Oh, that's just great, Swan. Oh my god, are you serious? No, I stabbed you first. Oh my god. Oh, you're back. I was about to say. <laughs> wow. Yeah, he keeps doing that. I have no idea why. There's a killer. There's a uh, excuse me, a killer sick combo that Ghost does. Um, it's just like every other um guy that's in uh the hunts. But if he does it to you, it's really bad. Where are we? Wait, are we in the Bowery? Oh, no, we're in... I don't know. Okay, yeah, we're... Okay, no. We're in the electric... Yeah. I thought we were in a... I thought we were for a second. I guess not. We're fighting electric eliminators. One thing I like about the eliminators is they're not afraid to break dance. Them and the moon runners. Oh, come on. This isn't gonna end well. Come on, shoot. I'm waiting for you. Yeah, get it in the background.
Way to face the wrong way, Swan. See, that's what I don't like about Swan's moves. It takes him too long for his moves to connect because he all busy trying to look, you know, all graceful and shit. I'm like, what matters is moves that can whoop a nigga. We don't have time for you to finish, you know, your third combo. Oh. They're both gone, okay. Oh, I got six credits now. Oh, shoot a hi-hat. Ah, damn, I forgot about the hi-hats. <laughs> uh, in that aspect, I love the Eliminators. I'm just gonna say that right now. For the fact that I forgot about the hi-hats, I love the elim. Oh yeah, that whole elevator thing. You're not Chatterbox. Oh well, screw it, let's fight. Yeah, this hat looks better on me anyway. Oh, let me just... Like, I'm gonna wait for the elevator to open up. Oh, hell no. Now you gotta get it. Taking your damn hat. Oh, wait, no, I'm not. That's my hat. I forgot some of the gang members die with their hats on. I don't know how that happens. Guess some gang members care more about their hats than they do surviving. I freaking hate Armory the Nice though. It's like it's a cool aspect, but you just feel shortchanged in some ways. I wanna be on stage three, come on. If I make it. <laughs> oh, look at that face. Look at this fool posing near the door. You better help your comrades and fight. For someone that's not Chatterbox, you ought to have your ass whooped. Okay, I'm getting real tired of that. Come on, I know you're there. I had to stab a dude off screen, I'm sorry. Okay, he should be close now. This is his sorry ass gallery trying to. Oh, wait. Like I said, stay away from the window. They can throw you out the window, I think. I've had it happen, and it is not good. Here we go, fat boy. Gee, thanks for letting me wail on him while, while, while you do nothing. Nothing. Oh good, there are three flash here, that's great. I don't know, Chatterbox is a little bit too easy for my taste. So we were in Soho, okay. Oh god, the train scene, okay. Do not get hit by the uh, scene because you are, I mean, the train. <laughs> the train, you do not get hit by the train because you will lose. You know, if I was an old person, that combo would not bother me. Yeah, so you're dealing with punks and yeah, they're a lot tougher apparently. Come on, Swan, turn around and whoop them. Dang. God. Oh, never mind. That's a freaking turnstile, I thought. Dang it, Swan. Oh my god, I just want to kill this dude. I was trying to get him to throw one of them into this next, uh... Ah, oh, shoot, it wouldn't have mattered. Okay, never mind. Yeah, so, uh... Don't stand in the... Don't stand on the train tracks when, uh... Okay, you really pissed me off, Swan. Seriously, dude.
Damn. Okay, well, I can't stand the train too long. Oh god, I hate this part the most. This is the worst part of this stage. But, yep. Okay, hurry up and get over there. Oh hell no, run. Swan, run, or you'll get hit. Oh, you di Oh no, he didn't die. How the hell you didn't die? Oh, he died right there. I hate this freaking army of the night bullshit. Yeah, so that means since we're seeing the punch, the Lizzie should be coming up right, you know, in a minute. I don't know when. Because if you remember, uh, both of them were in chapter 17, so, yeah. It's all about the distance from the warrior's, uh, place in Coney, so. <sighs> Swan's pissing me off right now. He normally doesn't, but it's just this mode, and since he's the only available character, he's really pissing me off. Okay, here's the leader of the punks, I guess, or the... Yeah. Fucking hate this dude. I don't like the punks anyways. I'm taking your freaking hat. Oh, I'm already at full health, okay. That was stage two. You see, I'm not going to make it past stage three. Not going to make it past stage three. I'm still going to try, but, uh, this is a commitment. Yep, Lizzie's. I guess the only thing I can say is at least they're weaker than the average, uh, you know, average uh, gang member, but that really doesn't help, does it? Let's just hope Star doesn't have a gun this time. And if you don't know who Star is, she's the leader of the Lizzie's. With that being said, you will probably find less flash because of the fact that you're fighting the Lizzie's. Like I said, it depends if Star has a gun. I love the fact that she ta she tried tackling him and for some reason, he didn't fall over. I'm not talking about falling over and dying, I'm just talking about falling over from the impact. What the hell are you guys cheering for? You gotta admit the Lizzie's are smart though. They wait they wait until the warriors arrive at their platform and then try to take them out on, on um episode 17. The punks pretty much they just waited until the warriors came to them, but if they won at first crack, they kinda missed it. Wait, is that oh shoot. Yeah, I'm just gonna kick that just in case. Oh, she's just standing there, I love that. Come on, Star, I know you're still alive. Thanks for wasting my time. <laughs> it took forever to even try to... Chick, you still alive, don't lie. You know, I'm gonna wait for her to come over here. <sighs> wasting my damn time. Yeah, I don't like this. Uh oh. Oh, boppers. I was close. I thought the hurricanes. Still in Harlem. Different part of Harlem. Yeah, so you can't. That's the thing. If, if they're just standing there, you can't kill them until, like, the scene allows you to hit them. That's why that dude took 10 hits without dying. Put that down. You're not the Furies. I knocked their hats off, though. I guess every time you defeat a... Wait, no. That's not true. Okay, I don't know when you get up. 
Okay, I heard that sound. One of y'all used flash. Cheap bastards. Oh, come on, Swan. You couldn't hit that guy? Really? He's right there. This is wrong for me to feel like I want to kill Swan right now. I'm getting in that damn club, too. Now watch, even though I got a hat, they still gonna wanna fight me. Unlike the story. It's a shame I couldn't get a freebie, but what do you expect? Yeah, you guys dance while I get my ass kicked. Well, I am the foreigner. You ain't using Flash, I saw the way he was standing. That's how you know you're getting ready to use Flash. Mm -mm. Nah, partner, you ain't doing that one. Oh, hurricane time. Which is stupid, because I didn't even get to fight Big Mo. Oh, okay. Never mind. We're still in Harlem. I just saw that, um, that mural on the wall, and I thought, okay, we're done with... I was about to say, give Big Mo dues now. Money clothes, pretty hoes. I love how they just follow her by, like, pretty much flipping their body over. Like, they look like they twirl when they die. That's hilarious. Okay, what the hell is he doing? He completely missed. Okay, Tommy G, your ass about to get whooped. Come on. Now watch him try to tackle me. Told you. And his ass got laid out doing that shit. Okay, let's see what we can do. <sighs> hate it when they do that. Yeah, dance. I can't throw my dollar. Oh, shit. Looks like Debbie, a whole bunch of her friends, and Big Mo. I think that's Debbie dancing in the background. It's a shame none of the villains get to talk in this game. I'm not sure if the rules still apply. Um, oh, there's Candy. See, I knew it. Nobody wants you, girl. Get over there, quick. I'm taking your fat ass hat, too. Chick, give it the program. Either fight or don't, but... Took forever. Get up. You up. Come on. Oh, I'm still not done with stage three. See, this is that stuff I'm talking about. I only got five credits. You could not just knock a pimp half. Ooh, you just did not knock a pimp hat off. Ooh. Knock a pimp hat off, your ass get whooped. That's automatic. That's why Big Mo was all over me. I wish I could go th throughout the whole game without losing this hat, but uh, it's, it's going to get lost sooner or later. You know who I'm dreading though? The Furies. They're going to kick his ass all over the town. Hmm, 
I wonder. Oh, there's some flash, but is there anything in here? Ain't this a bitch? Ain't nothing in there. Whack. I don't know how many times I gotta tell you not to knock off a pimp's head. Your uppercut ain't worth nothing. Get out of here with that. Oh. Wait, how the heck am I supposed to... Okay, what? Okay, let me back up, because I can't... Okay, I'm trying to get through the damn gate. Okay. Oh, I gotta go all the way around there? Well, that's kind of stupid. I just burned a whole bunch of time. I burnt like 15 seconds. Pay attention, you're gonna get stabbed. <sighs> Swan, pay attention, you're gonna get stabbed. There we go. Oh, shit. Come on. Aw, oh, I stabbed the wrong guy. That's okay. Got this, though. Wait, that's not a knife. Yeah, knife over the bat. I know knives last less, you know, they don't last as long, but... Oh, God. That's who I think it is. Oh, dear God. Oh, they still want me to go. Dang it. Damn. Yeah, and dude's still throwing stuff at me. I forget his name. Dang it. This is not good. Come on, dude. Are you going to fight it? Oh, yeah, of course. You're going to try Bitch. You got laid out. Shut up. Damn Diego. Then I gotta deal with Vargas too? I think. I forgot his name for a second. Okay, Diego, yeah. I gotta deal with him. Oh, damn. He's gonna die. Oh, no. He's. Well, he might still die. There's always a possibility Spawn can die. Oh, God. It's Vargas. Oh, that's just wonderful. Oh, wonderful. In the face. Come on, fatty. I should grab that knife in the background, but I don't know if I'm going to need it. And you're down. Oh, I'm done. I don't have to fight. What's his name? Oh, that is such a cop-out. I think I know why you don't have to fight him, though. Stage 4 is a killer, though. Um, oddly enough, Stage 4, as much as it is a killer, it's like the stage I don't have problems on. If I lose, it's because it's either usually because it's on Stage 4, I mean, Stage 3 or 5. Pizza. Oh, shit. Orphans. Get, I can't believe we had to wait this long to fight Orphans. They better have some heck of a Trump, you know, a Trump card, because, really? Y'all better pull a rabbit out your head, a gazelle, a lion, everything else, too. Orphans. Like I said, it's all about distance, how far they are from Coney. If you look at that map in the hideout, that will probably tell you who you'll be fighting. Now, there's also variations, so, you know, just because they're this far away doesn't mean you'll be fighting them, you know, when you think you do. For the most part, you will, though. Orphans. I can't... I'm surprised they didn't omit you out this this uh, little challenge here. I would have rather... I would have rather see the, uh, the, uh, the Van Cortland Rangers than you guys. And they call them Rangers, they don't get no love in this game. <laughs> I mean, they're noticed by um, Cyrus when he talks, like, they literally cite the Van Cortland Rangers, but they don't literally have any, you know. Waste my damn time. I guess that's why 4 isn't hard at the beginning. At the end, I can't guarantee that, because I think on stage 4 you still have to deal with, um... Oh, guys, this is a train scene, I think it is. Yep. How the hell am I supposed to know a train's over there, though? That's fake. That's the fake part. I got nine credits. Oh, shit. So stay away from the far left side if you can help it. 
do not let them grab you under any circumstances unless they're going to pin you to the ground. But even then, because they can still grab you and... See, I don't like that, how they say train. Well, bitch, that's nice. There's a goddamn train, but where the hell is it coming from? Sully! It's still saying train. The scene hasn't ended yet, and it still says train. Okay, so, idea. Throw Sully's stupid ass in the train. And I guess he's dead. I guess that's why four isn't... Oh, shit. Jesse died, damn it. I don't know who you are. You're a no-namer. Yeah, see, I would go over there and get that flash, but ooh. No, get out the... Oh, okay. I think... I don't know when the Furies is coming up. I'm not gonna lie, but I'm wor that's what I'm worried about. I'm not even worried about the rifts. Moonrunners! So yeah, you're supposed to also see the... I guess you're supposed to see the Van Cortland Rangers here, too, but I guess not. I don't know. But yeah, they could have just took out the the orphans and then just put them there even though we didn't officially have a mission based on them then there's other gangs they don't even do like the saracens or the i guess because the saracens were friends with them or whatever but oh you sprayed me huh get the hell out my way bitch got bitch smack your name Magnum, I bet you small. Is it true that in the UK that Magnum's a type of ice cream? Because here, um, Magnum's something very different. <laughs> that was not meant to be funny, but yeah, I was hearing, um... Yeah, I was watching an episode of Jeremy Kyle, and he said, yeah, Magnum's a, a ice cream over there in the UK. Now I'm curious, how is it? You know, the ice cream. Because, yeah, things over here, you would think because, you know, we, you know, Americans and, you know, people in, you know, Great Britain and the surrounding areas, you know. You know, we all speak, as well as, you know, Australia, we, you know, we speak English, but there's, you know, different dialects of that type of, you know, English, you know, American English, Queen's English, you know, Australian English, that sort of thing. So I'm just, you know, just curious, you know, like, just compare some weird, you know, some weird coincidences as far as food names and stuff, like, you know, I would love for someone to, like, PM me that, like, you know, if you are, you know, are from, like, Western Europe and you have, like, you know, or heck, even if you're, like, Eastern European, you know, anywhere, um, yeah, like, that example, like, okay, well, over here, this is called this, over here, this is called that, yeah, just let me know in the comments or whatever what you think, you know, like, it's just interesting, like, you know, the different, okay, yeah, that's why it's easy, because that was stage four, stage five, Now, here's the thing about stage five. It's very hard, but with that being said, I've never failed on stage five. <laughs> that subject is not change. But yeah, just let me know, you guys. Uh, what's it? Rogues. Okay. I could have sworn we would have been dealing with some, uh... Oh, hell no. I'll be damned if I'm outdone by a rogue. Get the hell out of here. Now I know almost full health. Y'all love to grab, don't you? But yeah, like I said, Mag Magnus over here or something else. I'm pretty sure you can find out what it is if you look it up, but I'm just curious. I also hear some Spanish speaking languages. Um, like I hear that, you know, okay, I know um, helado is, um, like helado is um, ice cream. But I heard in like one or two Spanish countries, like that means snow and vice versa. So, you know, like, I don't know. Oh, shoot. I forgot. Um, yeah, they can fall overboard and so can you. That's what makes five hard. So that's why I like grabbing and throwing you so they can F you up. Don't let them throw you. With that being said, it could probably happen to me. Never let them throw you. And be thankful when you're done with like that part that like they can throw you. Be thankful you're done with it. 
As easy as it is for you to throw them, they can throw you. Can't believe I'm on stage freaking five. I had the roughest start though. Swan died two times in less than three minutes <laughs> earlier, and I have 10 credits, and I don't know how. I usually don't have 10 credits, so something I must be doing something right. But yeah, stage four is short as hell. Wait, 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 come on, bring your ass over here. I know you're still alive. You know, I'm just gonna keep. Bitch, please, you wasn't finna grab me. Yeah, but Rogues look. Apparently, in this game, they love to throw you. I'm not used to that, but whatever. So, here's the thing I think the Savage Hunt, like, if it was about as far as strength, like, the, in level 5, should have been the Rogues, Savage Hunts, um, the Rifts, uh, all the strong games. And, of course, the Furies. I'm not sure if they're still if they're in uh, five or not stage five because it's been a while since I played this, but they weren't in it at all, and they gave us like well, they gave me the most problems. Is that who I think it is? <sighs> the Lord hold me back from whooping his ass. Bitch, bitch, slap your ass. Yeah, so, um, Loser's combo is kind of interesting. It does a lot of damage, though. Oh, I almost died, too. At least they're polite, though. They'll wait until you're done with your combo to hit, you know. Yeah, so that's the one instance one, you know, if you're going against a boss character, you have a hard time trying to do anything, so. Yeah, Loser grabbed him, whatever. Yeah, unfortunately your combo doesn't do anything to him, contrary to mission 18. But, I don't think you can really kill Luther like that. Oh. Yeah, so the whole idea was just for you to get in fights with him until you get tired. Oh shit, it is the Furies. This won't end well. But what I was saying is like, yeah, the Savage Hunts, they shouldn't be on uh, stage 2 or whatever. Fury. Damn. You. Hold on, I gotta pause. I'm sorry. I had to pause my um, headset once again. Um, Jeez. I know I've done this two videos in a row. I'm sorry. I just had to adjust my headset. Okay, I'm sorry if you hear anything. I just had to adjust my headset. Ready to go. I gotta remember. Yeah, on this, you don't have to throw. Here's the thing you don't have to throw them to make them lose their bat on this. I advise you to, but you don't have to. Damn it, Swan. Oh, he died. Okay, what? He died on the flash. <laughs> he died on the flash. That's hilarious. Yeah. Um. Swan died on the flash. I don't know if that should count as him dying or not. I don't think it should. Cause I think the minute you hit the floor, you should die. Not the minute you fall on the flash and then hit the floor. So yeah. Okay. Take it back. Um. You want to throw them? Oh, they didn't drop their bats. So I guess it's the opposite. Um. You want to hit them to get them to drop their bats. And bats don't break as fast, so that's probably why they use them. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Oh, oh no, I think I... Wait, is this the part I'm thinking about, or is this another part? I think that's further along in the level. Wait, something's wrong. Oh, yeah, I see what you guys are trying to do. They're trying to do a flyby on Swan. Okay, not cool. Okay, really? My health is... Okay. Apparently, they took away my health even though I was doing a combo. That normally doesn't happen. Fuck you. Fuck you. Bitch. When I'm fighting you, wait. You don't come over here and try to attack me. Really? Okay, I kicked him better die on the I'm sorry I'm getting really heated cuz stuff like that happens yeah 
in the wall. Oh, shoot, I can't go back and get it. Oh, yeah, I can. Okay. There comes a point when... Hold on, let me pause. Sorry. There comes a point when... My hands are getting sweaty. There comes a point, because I'm nervous, um, there comes a point where, like, if you go across the... Like, if you pass the screen, and you notice if you play the arcade fighting game or whatever, scroller, uh, if you go... If you go by the screen, like, say you missed an item, and, like, the screen goes by, like, okay, you see that bat? Okay, you see how the bat's gone, right? Okay, so as soon as it leaves the screen, it's gone forever. It's, like, out the... Out the memory of the game. And that's how the old... I was still able to grab it, but that's how they... That's how it worked. That is exactly how it works, and I'm getting ready to die again. Okay, where's the big guy? I'm getting tired of this. You guys just keep coming and coming, don't you? Oh my god, really? Bah. I'm making sounds I've never made before. Seriously. Up oh, there's the big guy so Dang, we was in a baseball field the whole time? Nah, I know we were, I'm just saying. Yeah, just keep smacking Cobb. Don't let him do anything. The only problem is there's other Furies around. See, I don't get that. He has those three bats, and then all he does is do that. He just kicks you. Really, dude? You can kick my ass, and all you do is that. I don't think he's ever even hit me with the bat. He's still... It's, that's subjective. It changed, but I'm just saying. Dang, dude. You never even hit me with the bat. That's insane. Oh, he hit me with the bat. Yep, see, he died. Okay. First time. First time he's hit me with the bat. The first time. Yeah, so his, hat, his bat's a one-hit kill. I guess. Or unless Swan had low health, which I doubt. I'm taking this. I lost my pimp hat. I already knew. I already knew I was going to. This is the... I want to say the last part of the game. I remember this. I don't know if this could be destroyed or not. I don't know, but I'm gonna have to drop it. I know I am. I remember the last part. I'm gonna have to drop it at some point. Yeah, so there's asshole with the, uh, there's Luther with the, oh, and Swan got hit. I don't know how the hell that happened. Run. Why are you still walking? So here's the thing. You're gonna have to attack him. I grabbed a bottle, right? So you're gonna wait. He can't attack you from down here. Um, oh yeah, this is timed, I forgot. Ah, oh, he hit him. Okay. Oh, it doesn't do that much damage. Okay, yeah, so you gotta do that. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah, this is kind of unfair. You missed? Yeah, I don't remember how this is exactly played, but I'm just thinking why I have eight lives. Yeah, so he's, he's gonna... Yeah, he's gonna die. Um, I don't remember how to do this. What? Okay, that's hacks. Bitch. Fuck you. Fuck you, fuck your mom. Ah, oh, crap. Okay, I just noticed that I lost the uh, triple bet I had from Cobb. That really sucks. Yeah, so Luther is supposedly dead. I'm hoping he stays that way. And we got Rift, so we're getting real close to the end. You marker aren't one of you cowards. It killed Cleon and it didn't even ask or chest kiss person for a gun. Bastards. No, I don't I don't really hate the Rift, but um, the armies of the night, they're the main villains for some weird unknown reason. I guess they're kidnapping Mercy because you uh, killed their leader, as if Cleon wasn't enough. I don't know, it doesn't make sense, I don't know. Kidnapping Mercy would seem like something uh, Luther would do, and then he'd have some kind of weird relationship with her. A non-healthy sexual relationship, I'll put it like that. I mean, come on. Luther's like, if you, if you met a guy like Luther, he'd be the creepiest guy you know.
Riffs. Yeah, right. <laughs> Okay, uh, I know I shouldn't grab that, because that's like the only one I'm probably going to get, but... Yeah, so for this, I don't know, can you smash your heads into the wall? No. Okay, you're going to have to fight them off by doing combos, and I suggest you push your XXX combo. Instead, don't do your AAA combo, because it just takes too long, it's too tiring. Okay, are you trying to kick me into the... Oh, they backed up. They're real smart, too. I know who I am, I'm a fucking warrior. That's right, the best. Just like Flashback B, I'm the mother best. I can't believe he let me combo him. Get yo punk ass up. I don't even know how to rescue Mercy. She caused a lot of problems. And you got kicked in the face. You know, I'm tired of this. Oh yeah, you can't, there's no rage mode in this, by the way. It just, it's like hacks. I mean, if you want to, you know, do a move wor worthy of rage mode, you can either throw them off something or smash their heads into the wall to instant kill. Most of the time. I'm tired of this Mario Princess Peach crap. <laughs> and that's the end. Ain't it? Oh, apparently it's not. Oh my god, Cyrus versus Cleon. A lot of ectoplasm to be seen. Don't even try to punch me like that, dude. You don't know who you're messing with. I hate the fact that, like, okay, um, Ghost of Cleon doesn't have his moveset. He has the typical punch once, punch twice instead of his, you know... That's that's kind of whack. Cleon doesn't have his combo as a ghost. So yeah, we beat the game, and there's Fox. Okay, Ajax, you pissed me off. You sold us out for a girl, and you got busted because of it. You know, I should make this so this is the. Uh... Yeah, I should make. I really should make that so that's the final video. But uh... let's just say that is the final video. Um. <laughs> Yeah, so, uh, wow, a little bit under an hour. Um, so I did Armies of the Night. Um, so we unlocked a new feature. Hey, stranger. And since this, okay. Uh, let's see. And, oh my god, look at that. 100%. 23 out of 23 for, uh... Story chapters, 40 out of 40 for bonus objectives, 469, yes. That's right, the Uber number, Uber epic number. I know what you guys are thinking, Uber's 1337. Well, my Uber number's 469, shove it. Um, yeah, playtime was 17 hours, two minutes, and for every one of these, I have done what I needed to do. Oh yeah, Army of the Night mode, yeah, I got the high score for that too. So there is a, a high score for Armies of the Night, so you're gonna be playing this for hours if you're not good at it. So yes, 100%, what more can I say? And the way you could, well, nothing much. Um, anyways, let me just, I'm just going to go outside for a second because I want to, I want to show you guys something. Um, it's more of a trivia thing than anything else. So, here's how you know if you got 100%. If you walk back in here and the Warriors theme song is playing, not the one that you hear at the beginning, but, um, oh shoot, it's not doing it. Okay, well, um, I'll have to show you next time, but there's a certain song that plays the, uh, Warrior. The warrior song, um, God, I wish this thing had a, uh, this thing doesn't, it doesn't have a, uh, a jukebox or something. I wish it did, but there's a certain song that's played, and that's how you know you've won. Let me see if I can change the station. Greetings, brother. Hey, man, how's it hanging? Nope. Oh, I like that song, but nope. Warriors bombing, baby! Warriors bombing. I saw some baby. No. No. Yo, man, what up?
Not this song. Dang it, that's all they're playing. Anyways, this is a sp excuse me. I can't talk today because I'm so I was so nervous. Okay, there's a specific song to be played. Um, if you beat the war is 100%. Oh, forget you then. Stupid radio. Anyways, okay, I'm gonna finish this video off because you guys are probably like, he's taking too long. What are you trying to prove? Anyways, there's a Warriors theme song. Um, if that's played in the background instead of the normal song, that's how you know you got 100%. I'll probably show it out to you next time. But anyways, all we have to do left is a uh, Rumble mode, and I'll be having a lot of fun in that mode. This is your boy Beast Month. I thank you for sticking along, watching Armies of the Night. Cause like me, I was, I was out of it the whole way through. <laughs> This is your boy Beast Mode. I will see you next time for Rumble Mode, which will be the last episode or the one before the last episode. Later.